Hello everyone, welcome again to the channel. Today I want to share with you this story about um, the laser air defense system that was uh, developed by Israel. We recently reported about this in a previous uh, video. So now this one says that Israel is going to ask Biden to OK giving Saudi Arabia the laser air defense system. So let's dig a little bit more into this. Um, so apparently Israel plans to ask the United States to approve the delivery of a new laser power air defense system to Arab countries, including Saudi Arabia. And this is part of the effort to build the anti-Iran anti alliance in the region, which hasn't even been um, created, but they already are talking about it like it's a done deal. So that is concerning for many reasons, like I already mentioned, which is the fact that uh, Israel and the United States, their only job in the, in the Middle East is to destabilize everything there. And now they're going to create an, an alliance to make it even more unstable and they are going to include Saudi Arabia and um, other other countries. So they are just mentioning something we already mentioned that Israel has uh, some military cooperation with Arab countries including United Arab Emirates and Bahrain. They are doing some cooperation with Saudi Arabia, even though their normalization of relationships, including uh, diplomatic relationships, hasn't started. But the main thing is that uh, this is new, that Israel wants to deliver the laser system known as the Iron Beam to the United Arab Emirates and also probably to Saudi Arabia, that's what they say. And the main thing is that the Israelis developed this system, but they want the support from the US to develop the weapon, which they say could be ready to be deployed next year. So they want money for that. That is the main thing why they want to involve the United States, and that's why they are begging them to give them the OK for this. If you're not aware of it, uh, the United States already provides about 3,800 million in military aid to Israel every year. And recently they created a new bill to add an extra 1,000 billion million in aid for Israel. And of course, we know what Israel is doing with their money, they're bombing the Palestinians in Gaza and killing people everywhere they, they can go. They are bombing Syria, they are bombing Iran, everywhere they are creating destabilization, you know, but they say it's for their own security, so nobody can criticize them. That's because the United States is protecting them in the United Nations and everywhere so they can get away with violating human rights, left and right, or everywhere. That's just the way things are. That's the status quo, and there is no political will to change that. So that's all I wanted to say, is just a quick update on this um, topic. Let me know what you think about it uh, in the comment section. And as always, I ask you to please like this video share it in social media and subscribe to the channel. I hope to see you again very soon. Thank you for watching.